so guys we're on our way to Barney yeah guys so we're gonna check out the bird sanctuary hummingbird to be exact so the place there my first time so I don't even know the location that well but we have a trusted taxi driver here carrying us yes So we reach at the location. Alright, so we're gonna knock up the people that wanna see what go on. Yeah. Come out of the car. Oi. So we just got here and the place it's beautiful already. This is our the seat where we sit on for the time being. It's all right now. Yes. Hi everyone. So this is the new reality. So Alright, so welcome to another Island Girl Adventure. It's your girl Shante and we're at another location, right? We're at Barney's Hummingbird Sanctuary in Weston. And today we're just going to visit and see what the birds is all about. So how long this place has been open? Yeah, we started, um, well, I'm here, I'm here 30 years, you know, I'm here 30 years in Jamaica. I came here and bought this property. At this time it was not developed, you know, we had no water, we had no light, not to mention internet. And, um, but you see, Jamaica develops and, uh, so we opened for the, it was a private garden. I was working in the tourist industry for more than 20 years, Jamaica's tourist industry, so I know the island, you know, taking German tours or European tours up and down from the Blue Mountains to the last cape. And then, um, so I collected. When on my, on my tours around Jamaica, you know, many, I have many sweet memories from Port Mariah and from Port Antonio and from basically all the places in Jamaica. I got collected plants. Okay. So and so the garden developed. I know a few of them. I recognize a few of the plants. Not all of them though. Um, so I recognize a few of the plants. I know some of them. Some of them are. So you see, at the moment, at the moment, since we try to, uh, I mean, uh, in the in the previous years, we have been incredibly uh, popular. You know, sometimes 15, 20 people here. You know. We uh, opened 2013 and then within six years we made it to the top attraction in, 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 in at least in Naples, you know. And many people don't want to travel so far, you know. They don't want to go a whole day to the Blue Mountains or whatever. They say, oh, what is, what is nearby? That's it. Exactly. And that made the garden incredibly popular. I mean, it was, it was, just, it was a, just a try, you know. We, discovered it and we started you know with a few people and then we tried to and then we did research how to attract hummingbirds you know uh. so and from now on we plant only uh, uh, trees and plants um, attracting hummingbirds okay because i know the nuni yeah. this tree right see, here attract a lot of hummingbirds hitting the most important uh, trees with with uh, little little uh, boards so the people can uh, get some basic yes. information. Noni tree is very important. You yes. know Noni. Uh, yes. Make Noni trees in Jamaica. I have one in my yard. You see? <laughs> but you know, we have it for the white flowers. Hello. Like Hello. Yes. We have it for the white flowers. The white flowers attract one tiny bird, the second yes. smallest hummingbird in the world. No way. We see. Oh, I see some. Oh my God. What? I saw a hummingbird just now. It was over there. Don't just be patient, you know. You see, this is the problem with many, uh, no, with some of our visitors. They're just not patient, you know. I mean, it's not a video. I cannot, sometimes they come 9.30, 10 o'clock, sometimes none, sometimes many. So they, they sometimes they give a lot of stress to our tour guides. I have two tour guides, which are laid off now. No money, okay. no honey. 
<laughs> Definitely. I try to keep them once a week, you know, to, to give them at least some basic, you know. I mean, we live together as a community, nobody, you know. I don't think nobody, nobody's hungry here. No. Yet. <laughs> Not yet. We have so much fruit trees, right? Yeah, Jamaica is so rich now, and now people can plant and, you know, and get their own. Yeah. We try to plant, you see, I tell you a story, you know. This is a magic, this is just pumpkin, you know, but it's not beer. Uh. And when you go on our Facebook page the other day, we started to plant plant and then we had to lock down in March. Yes, because everything started in March. So for the almond birds, like, what do you put in, in this? Yeah, this is sugar water. Just a regular sugar? No. Uh, no, white sugar, white granulated sugar. The brown sugar is not clean enough, you know. There's too much molasses in it, you know. It's not eat them honey and syrup, you know. They would kill them, you know. Anyway, they would not touch it. They know what to eat. Oh, okay. Animals know what to eat. No, it's 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 water. It's just water. Okay. It's not. Uh, you, you 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 mix it at a certain formula. One part of sugar, four part of water. Okay. Let's go. Very, 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 very. Don't go, you're not feeding. Yes, look at this is a little. Next feeder here. Ooh. See? And this is the national bird. And the mango. All oh. hummingbirds are very uh, um, territorial. They constantly fight for territory. As soon as someone discovers something nice with flowers and food, they chase away the other ones. Okay. It's the first that I'm knowing yeah, about they it. Hum- they are not family birds like other birdie, 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 birdie. Birdie, 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 birdie. Yes, people, so all who know a cucumber, okay? Pine tree, see cucumber there. You have, a, you have a mango up there. You have a mango high in there. Oh, here's oh. Birdie, 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 my little friend is here. They are fighting. Birdie, birdie, birdie. See here. Oh my god, see in there. See in there. Oh, oh, no. Come, birdie, birdie. No, he's still hiding. He has no time to feed. He has to chase up the mango. Come now, birdie, birdie, birdie. OMG. I love this place. Oh my god. Oh, he's so fast. Oh gosh. Birdie, 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 Oh, guys, you have to wait a little because we want to feed the bird. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, no, look here, look here, look here. I try to get in the sun. That's my friend. Now come. Now come. He's a little shy. Come, 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 come. Every morning, actually every day. OMG. At least something. So guys, we are here right at Burnley's and the place is absolutely lovely. Um, there are so many different plants here and fruits. It's a cucumber, it's a passion. It's a lot of different stuff. And the almond bird, oh my god, he is absolutely so nice, right? I'm sure we have a few more visitors coming in. Oh my god, he's right here, like look at the people. <gasps> Whee! Whee! Like look at me, I don't even know if I catch it in the video, like this thing just come up right beside me. Oh my god, he is so pretty. He is so pretty, like, oh my god. But there's three different species here. We only have these hummingbirds in Jamaica, so guys, cherish them, do not harm them. If you see them, just let them be. You can feed them, as the gentleman said, with just a little bit of sugar and water to attract them. And like I said, have new trees. If you have some new trees in your home, that can definitely attract them. So just live and love and be peaceful. And like, show, <laughs> like, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell. So don't miss another video, OK? And guys, guess what? Now, of course, you have to subscribe here. YouTube now got charger. Not one penny to subscribe. So subscribe and like this video. Give this video a thumbs up.
Welcome, you know. This welcome to Barney's Garden, Barney's Flower and Hummingbird Garden, you know. Mention uh, or watch the name. It's not only hummingbirds, it's uh, flowers also, you know. We have a big collection of uh, trees from all around uh, Jamaica, half of the world, you know, from Africa, from India, from uh, South America, and so on. So it's a, it's a paradise for garden lovers. Entrance fee is 20 US dollar. And for Jamaicans, we reduced the price. It was thousand dollar. Now for any Jamaicans, uh, it's five hundred dollar because uh, some of us have a hard time, lost their job, you know, get laid off because of the virus. So it's five hundred dollar for Jamaicans. And uh, next important thing, it's not a playground for children. You know, you have to be careful and silent. And virtually, we accept them from six years upwards. All right. So, and uh, I think this little um, uh, introduction or this little interview is a good, is a good, um, uh, good opportunity to say thank you to uh, our community, you know, because I have to uh, mention, you know, this is not a white man's business where old white man yeah, does his own thing. It's, uh, we have three uh, Jamaicans working here for more than six years. And this place would never be possible without the, without the support of the community, you know, the approval and without the, uh, the work of our gardeners. That's a good way to say thank you, you know, I hope it will stay this way. At the moment we have a hard time, I have to lay them off, they come only once a week or twice a week, how we get visitors, you know. But we hope we can uh, come back to full force. And at the moment we are starting a new um, project on the internet, we are starting an online show. People can contribute and the online show is only made to support the salary of our workers because the garden is growing, you know, it's growing, you know, I'm 76 years old. I can't, to say it in Jamaican style, I can't manage it anymore <laughs> alone. <laughs> this means I cannot manage it anymore yes. on my own, you know, I need help, I need support, you know, so, and we need money that people want paid, people have to yes. live, you know, they don't do it for free, simple. Their families, they need to, uh, you know what. Yes. Thank you very much. guys we had a lot of fun here with the almond birds today and i enjoy every bit of it it was very good and interesting learning about the birds and what they have to offer one came up to me sound like a helicopter in my ears yo but it was nice nevertheless so we're going to leave remember to please share like and subscribe to this video if you like it give it a thumbs up okay so Love you guys. Enjoy the rest of your day. Peace. I'm out.